I'm struggling to process everything that's going on. It all just feels like a horrible nightmare that I can't wake up from. I feel like I'm living in a twilight zone. I keep asking God, why? Why, Lord? Please help me understand. These were Connie's words as she mourns her husband. Hello and welcome to Entertainment News in Zansi. Now, if you're new to my channel, you know you're here for the story. Go ahead, click the subscribe button and the bell and you'll never miss an update. Now, when Zanzi heard the shocking news that media mogul Shona Ferguson had died on Friday, most said they couldn't imagine what his wife Connie was going through. Shona died on Friday afternoon at the Milk Park Private Hospital in Johannesburg from COVID-19 related complications. Connie revealed that since Shona died, she's been reeling, filled with questions of why. Now, Connie also revealed that as she struggles to deal with her husband's death, July 31 was also the anniversary of the first time she met Shona in 2001. This day 20 years ago, 31 July 2001, was the day God brought you into my life and we haven't looked back since. Ours is a once in a lifetime kind of love. We joked about how we were going to be in our old age, how we would take turns supporting each other and being strong for each other. The irony is we have already been doing that for the past 20 years. Oh, how God has loved me to give me you. We were already planning our 20th wedding anniversary in November, assuming that we had time. You and I were joined at the hip. Now I feel completely off balance and complete without my other half, my soulmate, Connie said. Now fellow Thurspian, Silomake Gangnube, who acted alongside Ferguson in a number of productions including Zanzi Magic Drama, The Queen, expressed his condolences to fellow actress Connie, Ferguson's widow. My sister, I literally feel your pain. I have no words I, I can say which will soothe the grief you are feeling. Only the hand of life can carry you through this one, he wrote. Now Zanzi, there you have it. I myself are still in disbelief. Uh, Shona's death just feels so personal, I think, for most of the people in Zanzi because of such an inspiration he has been. Now, do leave your thoughts on the comment section below. I love to hear from you. But for now, you know I will bring you the updates.